BAM box. Don't want to do that too loud. But the BAM box, uh, I haven't done this in a while. I haven't done the unboxing in a while. Uh, very excited though because BAM box, oh man, always has some kind of awesome artwork. I hope I didn't just jinx the box, but usually they have some really good artwork, really awesome artwork, celebrity signatures. Let's open it up and see what we got. So, got some uh, stuff in here. Some protective stuffing, okay. I wanna get like a small item first. It, what is that? That must be a part of another item. Okay, I think something broke apart in here. There's like different pieces to it. Okay, so I took out a couple of things. Uh, this might go together some, some way, somehow. Uh, oh yeah, it does, okay. So it looks like you got a little stand here with this. If you can see that right there, tell me what that is. What is that? I'm gonna put this down real quick because I don't know what is going on. It's just gonna sit here until I figure out what is going on. Next, we have a, what is that, Decepticon? It's probably Decepticons, but you got a patch there. We also got a one-up congratulations yellow card, which means you have an upgraded or limited edition item in your box, which is, that's cool, that is cool. Bam box, good job, keep doing this right here. Cause I like when you get a green or a blue or a yellow card, it means you got an upgraded item or a limited edition item. That is really cool. Stranger Things Chief Hopper Badge Replica. Oh really, that is that is really cool. That is pretty awesome. And that is, that is solid. This is like an actual badge, it is heavy. Chief Hopper from stranger things you get his badge right there look at the look at the quality of that and this thing is heavy so this is like a legit police badge that is a really cool item especially i think i think stranger things is going to be very it's already successful but i think they're going to have a bunch of seasons to come uh because the show is so popular but that is really cool right there i like that uh you got a pin and this look this looks like Arnold, and I think it is. On the back it says, Limited Edition Enamel Pins, The Terminator Franchise. Right there. Maybe that's the Limited Edition, I, I don't know. Okay, and then you have two art prints. First item, all right, all right, what is, the, okay. I, I think I see Carnage. That is awesome. I'm a big fan of uh, Carnage. So this, on the back you got a certificate of authenticity. I will read it as you guys check out this Carnage picture. It says the BAM original box fan art collection art print Maximum Carnage has been hand signed by artist Brett Weldell, Waddell, I guess, and is guaranteed to be authentic. Very awesome. Uh, 173 out of 250 was this one right here. Maybe you can see that. Maximum Carnage right there. Awesome. I, I love their artwork that they do. Love it. Uh, and then next, right here, we got some Poison Ivy. And we have a Certificate of Authenticity right there. And I think that might be the voice actress or something for Poison Ivy. Let's check it out. As this 8x10 photo has been hand signed by Diane Pershing, who voiced Poison Ivy in Batman, the animated series. It was signed during a private signing with the band. Bot. That's really cool. Very, very nice. I like that. Two really cool pieces of art with celebrity signature and artist signature on these two pieces uh, of artwork, artwork, art print. Uh, really awesome. But the thing I, I'm confused now because I don't I don't know what this this is for. There wasn't an info card inside. I believe that there should be one. There usually is one, like a little booklet that'll show you everything that you got in here and what you could have got different. Did it fall out or something? I couldn't find another review online to show uh, the booklet, but I did see uh, the franchises and apparently this is Game of Thrones, whatever this is. On the back right there, you got that. I think this might be that like assassins coin or you know the no the no face man because right there basically you have a no face man so I think that's the coin this opens up and I guess you can like move this around however you want is this in Game of Thrones just sitting there like this I, I don't know but a little display case basically a pin and a badge and then you got another like replica item or movie item which is really cool and then they add two pieces of like artwork so the artwork only makes up like 20 percent of the box now so i i think it's really cool and i love i love the artwork like one day i'm gonna get some frames for all of the artwork i have from the band box that was it and and then this right here was really cool this little replica this is heavy 
Like, it's really heavy. I want to drop it so you hear it, but I don't want to mess it up, so I'm not going to drop it. But this is this has a lot of weight to it. That is really cool. That's it. Let me know what you guys thought of this box, the items inside. What did you think? Down below in the comments, let me know. Uh, and did anyone else get this box and get different items? Let me know down in the comments. Uh, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Stay solid. Into